Welcome to Math with Mr. J. In this video, I'm going to cover how to solve and graph a compound inequality involving and. Let's jump into our example where we have 4c minus 5 is greater than or equal to negative 9 and less than 7. Now when we solve a compound inequality involving and, we can solve everything all at once meaning we can solve both of the inequalities that make up the compound inequality at the same time. And then once we solve, we can graph the solutions on a number line. Let's start by rewriting the compound inequality and we will solve from this. We need to look to isolate that variable of C. We have multiplication and subtraction, 4C minus 5. So we need to undo the subtraction first. The inverse operation is addition. So let's add five to the middle. That means we need to add five to the other parts of the compound inequality as well. So add five to the left and to the right. Now the fives in the middle cancel each other out. So we have four C is greater than or equal to and then on the left, negative 9 plus 5 gives us negative 4. And then 4c is less than. And then on the right, 7 plus 5 gives us 12. So now we have 4c is greater than or equal to negative 4 and less than 12. We need to undo the multiplication using the inverse operation, division. So divide the middle by 4. That means we need to divide the left and right by four as well. Now the fours in the middle cancel each other out. So C is now isolated. C is greater than or equal to. On the left, negative four divided by four gives us negative one. And C is less than. And then on the right, 12 divided by four gives us three. So C is greater than or equal to negative one and less than three. In other words, C has to be greater than or equal to negative one and less than three. So C has to work for both, satisfy both. Now let's graph this on a number line. And we will go from negative two to four, one number to the left of negative one and to the right of three. So here is our number line, and we will go from negative two to four. So negative two, negative one, zero, one, two, three, four. Negative two, negative one, zero, one, two, three, four. Now we want everything greater than or equal to negative one. So negative one is included. We need a filled circle at negative one to show that. And we need everything less than three. Three is not included. So we need an open circle at three. Again, we want greater than or equal to negative one and less than three. So we want where these two inequalities overlap. So we want in between here. And that C is greater than or equal to negative one and less than three graphed on a number line. So we solved and graphed the compound inequality. So there you have it. There's how to solve and graph compound inequalities involving and. I hope that helped. Thanks so much for watching. Until next time, peace.